right. Everything should be working. Okay. It has been a hot minute since I recorded a YouTube video. But what we're going to do today is try out this uh, monkey paradigm. See if it's good or not. Definitely not getting it to uh, degree 100. Not that will arrange power and synergies with other monkey towers and heroes for all balloons under assault. So I don't know anything about this. I Like I said, I haven't really played balloons in a while. All I know is that we're going to need a lot of money and a lot of monkey farms. So I would go and try the new map, but I say new with quotations because it's probably like a month old, a month or two old now. I don't remember when it came out. So let's find a map. Should I do this island? I'm only going to go easy because I don't know how much the the money is going to ramp up. Let's do Gerardo. What's this? Oh yeah, they have uh, challenges now. They don't really care about that. Uh, do I have ability? Where is he at? There he is. I'm blind. So let's get Gerardo and let's uh, try and get this Paragon. Put him here, and what do we got? Obviously, we're gonna try and get this extra figure as quick as possible. Oh, I don't have auto start on. I don't know. I don't know why I didn't. I don't actually use Geraldo that much. And now we just let that collect money. We're going to need that probably for one of the final upgrades. Damn, Geraldo sucks. I did not mean to. I think I want the main one to be right here. So I'm thinking this is going to be a preemptive stream. Mean, Energizer could. Is it in range of Gerardo? I think so. So this is going to be Energizer. And now we're just going to save up money to buy a farm. OK, wait. Should I go Banks? I'm thinking banks. Let's try it. Should have got Benjamin. This is what it is.
Oh, that's one thing. I'm going to need this up a little bit more. So I can see the candy corn. Oh, that's right. And it won't matter because we're not going to use that for that specific purpose. Should I get a banana from it? I don't know, that's you need to. What I wish they did in this game was what they did in Blue Star Defense 5, where if you use a specific, like the Banana Farmer, if you use the Banana Farmer a certain amount of times, it basically upgrades into a better one. I forgot what it was called, uh, what the Banana Farmer specifically was called. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, we're not going to want to submerge just yet. And, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sure. I need something that's just camo. It's going to be a while. All right, now let's start going for farms. Fun. Fun. Hey, Gerardo is definitely good, but if we're talking just using Gerardo, don't even try it. Like, his attack is so bad. But, like, this shop, I think the shop's a neat idea. All right, I think now we can. Oh. I think now we can submerge it. I do need Gerardo upgraded for Paragon Totems because I'm still going to see if I can go for a high Paragon level. But I'm not going to make myself try and get 100 because I don't know the requirements for it. What I do know is I'm going to need a lot of subs. So let's just place a whole bunch back here. Easy peasy. All right. I need a whole bunch of pops and money spent. I'm pretty sure. It's... We'll see. Uh, I think like 30 uh, Gerardo Paragon Totems is good. Around 30. I don't know. Can't place any more there. The bad part is, well, yeah, th this is why I picked this map, because it's a whole area surrounded by water. Because you need a lot of water space. So if you're doing this on a land map, you're going to be using a lot of uh, the portable, what's it called? 
portable why is it a portable lake when it's I'm trying to put logic into a fictional game. I will be getting uh spike factory. Actually, eleven K, twenty seven K. This isn't the best way to farm. Like if we're going primarily on money, then you're gonna want top path, middle path, but it don't matter to me. Let's just do this. What is Ah, uh, you can't do that. That's bogus. So what I'm thinking is, I think two villages would be fine. One here and one here. Does it hit that? Yeah. I think that'll be fine. I think we're going to go and get the sub commander first as extra piece of damage to commander and all subs so all these subs over here uh not that one we'll get extra damage oh, that's pretty good let's upgrade all these I don't know what the best path is for these, but I'm going to go two zero zero for now. Probably going to go two zero two because it's more expensive that way. What I'm thinking is we have this side over here and we have over here regular ones. I should put the banana farms first. Let's see. I can probably put it here and put some another at the top and then one down at the bottom. Let's see. Oh, it's gonna be a tight squeeze, so let's see if I can do this. I can definitely place one here. What if I no? I'll put him there. Perfect. And now we go to the top path. Uh, 
I might have to go easy click for these top ones. Because I see that they're going out of his reach. But everything else should be fine. Thirty one K. Wow. I should probably get energized here. Let's get rid of this blue, why not? No, I should get first strike first. I want to see something. Didn't mean to get another IMF low and that'll be fine. Hello, crab guy. This won't be the fastest, but we'll see what they can do. I just need Geraldo at level 20 now. That should be golden. If I get all of these ballistic missiles, that'd be kind of crazy. I will be getting Prancer Strike. Oh, this is probably a good time to turn my effect skill down to 20 or so. Oh, that's right. I need space for the totems, too. 22,000. Steep. 
for a totem. That's going to be a little bit. Yeah, it's gonna be a little bit. I still need to energize you too. What else would be good? I might get, I might get a, uh, what's it called? It's been so long, a sticky bum. Just to pop the bed, but I bet this stuff could do it. Not exceeds core. Oh, it's 340, all right. Was not middle no bad, that's for sure. How many pops does this have? 500k, 500k, 5k. Only 5? That's kind of crazy. All right. Uh, I don't know how long it's gonna take to get four hundred k, but if I if I fail this, I could just do it on. Oh no, I can't. There's no water on Monkey Meadow. We'll just see what I can get. I'm only gonna get like fifteen of these, something like that.
Hmm. Interesting. I like that. All right. So we got a whole bunch of ballistic missiles now. We just got to get money. So, hey, I'm waiting for a, a banana farm paragon. That's what I'm waiting for. Uh, I should probably buy more paragon totems. We got nine. Oh, I forgot. I still have this, but it's only at 196 seems... Small. I want to get this uh, Paragon before round 140. Because I do not want to deal. Is it? I'm pretty sure it's a. Is that a two of them or it's four to five? I don't remember. I'm hoping for at least uh, 40. Because there's, yeah, I'm hoping for at least a 40. Yeah, we just need to survive now. Can I sell these? Wait. Yeah, for... Six thousand less. I'm probably gonna have to sell this uh, action figure to to get what I want. 
because my money situation is it's just falling apart. How many of these do I have now? Fourteen. Yeah, why well, they go to twenty or twenty five? This will be my first look at the. I haven't seen any gameplay of it either, so we'll see if it's good or not. Altered my effects up. I do not care. There's 15. Sixteen. Ooh. Seventeen. Uh, yeah. Well. All of these guys have like a weird amount of pops, like 70 to 90, 90s, 200 apparently, 80, 70. So I feel like the pops requirement should be good. That's kind of funny. That's kind of crazy. So apparently my recording sucks, they didn't have space. So I didn't get the whole second half of that. So let me show you what it does. I did easily uh, solo round 40 with them. But yeah, he's pretty freaking good. He's just decimating everything. Like the bats? Not a problem. A little bit of a problem. But... I don't know if I want to do it because so when you submerge him, he basically, yeah, that that happens. He can stun them. He can stun them. That's the thing. He can, but half the time he doesn't. And his his ability, you got fifteen seconds, and that, and you got like radiation on the ground. So he's pretty good. You can see him racking up pots. I didn't get the whole part of me buying him. Uh, but yeah. I, ju I basically just collected all my money and sold everything and bought him. I managed to get degree 77. So Geraldo really does help with the Paragon totems. So I would say if you're trying to go for solo Paragons, then use Geraldo. I also said something about how I didn't realize that these changed. I didn't know. Like, the stack of old nails is now a spear. This is white. Don't know what kind of goo is in there. Uh, these aren't rusty. I wonder if these do anything different. Do they just shoot faster? Yeah. So I think Gerardo just revamped his stuff. So yeah, this is what he does. Uh, he's pretty good. Just be careful when you're using the ability because it does take 15 seconds and stuff like that can happen. I It does shoot two of them. And as you can tell, one hit up here, the other hit down here. That's because the... The DDT was up here. I'm racking in money right now. Let me just buy that. So, yeah. 
it's pretty good. I think I could definitely get a hundred, but I don't really want to. Anything else? Yeah, the fortified BAD didn't even stand a chance. I wonder what happens if the round ends before. I don't know. So yeah. Uh it's pretty good. See ya.